Cause he'd be like, wah! Oh. What's up guys, Leandre Sanders. I got this thank you board that Alfonso Rawls design. There's a lot more legends on this skateboard. Go copy one at StockX. Let's go. How I found out about this was my friend, he just like tagged me in a barracks post saying like, hey bro, like you're about to be on a board. I was just like, no, there's no way. So I'm here like searching for my name, like a happy little kid. Oh snap, I don't see it yet. I don't see it yet. And I ended up like not seeing it. So I kind of thought that, you know, yeah, you're in a thrash magazine, but you're not gonna be on the board. So I look again 30 minutes later and I'm just like excited as hell when I see I'm in the center, like right above the trucks. And I was like, dude, the positioning was so choice for me. Like there's people way better at skating that are gonna be like underneath the trucks. And I was like, dude, that is crazy. This guy was really looking out for me, you know, or he just randomly put me like center, just prime location. So I had to go cop it and we're about to open it up. Yo. Front and center, right above Tommy Finn, Julian Cummings. I'm on a freaking skateboard. My name is on a freaking skateboard. Yo, watch movie. Ty, real quick. I mean, you don't really need pants. Oh, shit. You got it. Oh, shit. What's your name? Hey, right there. No, he didn't do it. He no, yes, he did. He did. <laughs> yes, he did. That's fucking dope. What size is this, dude? Man? Dude, perfect location. Like I'm above the truck, so I'm not gonna be hidden underneath here. Right. Lamont Holt is right up here, I top. Would, I would. They will not be making a lot of these. Not at all. You should definitely keep the plastic on that. Look, you see something? You see your name. You see it? Yeah, right here. Oh. Yes, sir. Wonderful. Yes, sir. Huge thank you to Alfonso Rawls and Everybody Skates in the Barracks. Thank you, skateboarding, for sure. I gotta hang this up somewhere, like right next to the Thrasher magazine. Like this is this is actually crazy. The little kid in me is definitely smiling. Like when I got that in the Thrasher magazine, but definitely like my name on a board. I might get a skateboard and like as merch. If you guys want one, like I could like design a board and make that a thing as far as like all i got right now is this shit which is pretty nice dope cozy comfy merch but to have my name on a board dude this is crazy i had a lot of friends that like saw this coming like people that were just like oh dude like you were so good at skating in high school like we knew that if you just kept going with it you know you would just definitely get somewhere with it but like you won't see it for yourself but other people will see it for you it's, it's pretty weird. It's a huge disconnect because you'll be judging how good you are at skating compared to like the pros who've been pros for like 10, 15 years and stuff like that. But you won't like think your skills are as like polished as theirs. So you'll get discouraged and stuff like that. But thanks to my sponsors, Houston Skateboards for just supporting me, just giving me boards while I was out in Houston. Still giving me boards while I'm out here in Florida. Dan, he's been an amazing mentor, good friend. I'm wearing the beanie right now and Today I'm at Royal Palm Skate Park. First time being here. Ground here is not that great, 
Like as soon as you hit this, you're hitting a crack right before this steep uphill. It's pretty narrow up in here. You know, this is the space you have to do your trick on the rail. The ground isn't flattering either. So push and go for it. Front foot. There you go. Bumps. You know what to do. It's my girl. Yeah, back to back. Yes, sir. Yes, that's little, sir. That's a little bit higher than the other one. Bend your knees. Bend your knees. There you go. There you go. Kick flip. Tray flip. <laughs> Nolly Gazelle. <laughs> 